introducing the co-founder of the social enterprise The Big Issue, John Bird, who is now a baron in the House of Lords and a promoter of social enterprises who aim to improve poverty in Britain. John is the entrepreneur who grew a social enterprise from scratch. The idea came from an American printing business venture that John modified to work for the homeless in the UK. The innovation behind the big issue was the opportunities it creates for homeless people to earn, as well as offering learning material, support for personal finances, rehousing help and advice for addiction, health and well-being. John Bird came from having nothing, living as a slum to a poor Irish family and was already homeless himself at the age of five. Being expelled from school and on the streets, John began to steal and was caught numerous times that landed him in prison twice. Prison was where John learnt about business and studied printing. He developed the psychological aspects of an entrepreneur's personality. Coming out of the hardest times of his life, John Bird was in his 40s when he became successful at running his own printing business in London. Then he joined forces with Gordon Roddick, who's the co-founder of The Body Shop. In 1991, together they launched The Big Issue. The Big Issue magazines were printed for London streets. Today the magazine's sales and business model for homeless is effective in four continents across the globe demonstrating that this is a radical innovation that is scalable and still has room for growth. This venture began its journey when the body shop provided the first funding capital of $50,000. The idea soon grew to become a weekly magazine and a business for homeless vendors. It was set up as a not-for-profit, the business model, that scaled, improving the lives of many homeless communities. The challenges that John Bird faced during childhood are still seen as critical factors of homelessness experience today. These include the breakdown of families, the housing and banking regulations that can be restrictive to low wage earners, the lack of affordable social housing, the limitations and availability of adequate care services for mental health or support for drug and alcohol addicts. John Bird has used his experience in the best way possible to make global changes to people's lives. It's inspirational how he designed a system that works for others and not purely for his own gain. This will influence future generations. John Bird suffered the challenges and he can personally relate to the needs of the homeless. The innovation in the UK was creative, as the magazine picks up multiple topics and engages a variety of people and causes, but still, the challenges faced by the homeless people today can be affected or influenced by outside social economic changes, such as new knowledge and changes in people's perception. Everyone can do something to make change.